This is a, like a class I really look forward to going to because mm -hmm. you you just don't you don't sit in a lecture you kind of be you're always engaging with people you're always interacting. Is there something really concrete that we're working towards rather than just trying to improve our academic skills in general? I mean, some of my other classes have like a final paper or something that's supposed to be kind of a cumulative kind of thing for all the work you've been doing over the course of the semester, but with the festival it's like an actual event, so it's really interesting to see how all the work you've been doing turns out. Describe the folk festival in three words. Three words. Bears beat Battlestar Galactica. Um, <laughs> three words. I would say a little family. Typical class is a lot of fun. In the beginning, we learn about our like folk culture and folk traditions um, and what we're actually celebrating about. And then the rest of it is kind of what are we doing to put on that celebration of folk traditions. Um, we contract our vendors and we do all of our busy work, almost like you would see a business work because it is a business. So you gotta go for this one over here. This one is our folk fest, what we need to this one. And then once you actually get into the whole thing, you'll see the over here. It's, it's a group of 14 students, I think, and working together, making everything come together cohesively is not easy. And doing that, it's going to be a huge skill to have. Learning out ways to make it work better is something going to help when I do have an internship or a job. So will they like? A lot of energy. People are running around. There's so much to do. Live music. There's food. Um, People can bring their dogs. We actually get to see our hard work pay off in the end with something so in your face. Like a lot of other classes, it's just so subtle where you know you might be able to recall one or two facts here and there throughout the years. This one, you get to see your hard work right in front of you. You get to see it in the smiles of the people that come to the festival, and you get to see it in your performers' eyes. It is a beautiful experience. It's taught me to be more open-minded. It's taught me to be creative, what's all my problems. And it's taught me to not take anything too seriously when it's a beautiful day on Cook Douglas, there's delicious food and music. Like you just gotta kind of, you kind of look back at it after so many months and months and months of planning and meetings and talking and emails and phone calls, and you're like, wow, I was part of something really great. Folk festival do something different. I never in a million years thought I'd be on the staff for a folk festival and it's really opened my eyes to like a whole different aspect of Rutgers and what Rutgers has to offer besides business so I think everyone should give it a chance. Cool. Why should people join the folk festival? The staff? Mm -hmm. Because of all the things I've been talking about and I'm sure other people are talking about. You know it's a good time free pizza weekly and you get to drive golf carts and wear walkie-talkies on your belt. Yay. <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> Hope she got the this is weird. <laughs> Come to the folk festival. It's gonna be awesome. Please volunteer. You'll get food, you'll get a t-shirt. 
it's going to be a great time. All of my friends who volunteered say they really enjoyed it. So uh, please come and support us.